It is impossible to escape germs, especially when you head to the grocery store. KSTO's Abigail Ogle did the dirty work to find the biggest mistake that we all make trying to wipe out germs. We've all touched them. Shopping carts. Specifically, those handles are a breeding ground for all types of nasty bacteria. But what about those wipes you see everywhere? Do they work? Well, with the help of Diagnostics Lab of Oklahoma, we did an investigation of our own. We went to three supermarkets to find out. First, we swab the handle without wiping it down. We label it and we store that sample. Then we wipe down the cart using the store's wipes. And hey, while we're at it, we wanted to know how clean are the wipe containers, especially since you have to touch the container to get a wipe in the first place. We're back now at DLO. We have all of our samples. They're labeled and everything. We need to head into the lab so our microbiologist can tell us how dirty those carts really are. Now, we let the bacteria grow for a few days. Then it was time for the verdict. First of all, how dirty were the carts without the wipes? A lot of bacteria on people's skins. That's uh, kind of indicative of feces. Did you hear that? Feces on the shopping carts all of us touch when we're at the store. But what about after the carts had been wiped down? Uh, the wipes, uh, after being wiped down, there was no bacteria at all. So, so very effective. Very effective, yes. Just take a look at the difference. Now, if you're like me, you're skeptical about those wipes, but as you can see from the petri dishes, the wipes definitely work. Barely any bacteria on the cart after I wiped it down. But there's a catch. While the wipes clean the carts, the wipe container itself is a bacteria cesspool. That one was a lot more bacteria like you see in feces. Don't touch the container, that's for sure, yeah. <laughs> so the moral of the story, wipe down your grocery carts. But don't touch the wipe container. Remember these images the next time you're shopping. Abigail Ogle, KOCO, 5 News.